सो हेलो एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू माई चैनल टूडे वी हैव अ क्वेश्चन ऑफ डिफ्यूजन करंट क्वेश्चन इज डिटर्मिन द डिफ्यूजन करंट फॉर निकल एंड कॉन्सेंट्रेशन ऑफ द सोल्यूशन इज गिवन इन मिली मोल पर लीटर टाइम इज गिवन इन सेकेंड्स वेट ऑफ द ड्रॉप इज ऑल्सो गिवन इन मिलीग्राम पर सेकेंड एन इज गिवन एज टू एंड D diffusion coefficient is given as 0.7 into 10 raised power minus 5 centimeter square per second. Now we need an equation which relate diffusion current with all these terms. That is concentration, time, weight, n diffusion coefficient. Thankfully, we have the equation that is called Ilkovic equation, and you know Ilkovic. Ilkovic equation that is a polar polarographic formula which connects the diffusion current I D with the concentration of the non polarizable electrode and what is that that is the chemical reduced or oxidized at the falling mercury electrode which is you know polarizable electrode so now C is given to us. and that is in milli mole per liter and that is required in milli mole per liter second part is n what is n number of electrons involved in the electrode reaction and that is also given as 2 id diffusion current the value comes out in micro amperes keep in mind these units are very important if the values are not given in those units you have to convert them into those particular units right now d diffusion current is given and that is in centimeter square per second m is mass of mercury weight of mercury that is flowing via the capillary in milligram per second that is given in milligram per second t is drop time in seconds given in the same unit and what is this constant 607 so 607 it is a constant for this numerical factors which includes faraday constant density of the mercury and all the other factors okay so you have to use this equation so let us solve it so just put the values so id is equal to the result id that is diffusion current is is comes out to be in micro ampere so 607 into n what is n 2 concentration is given in milli mole per liter that is 2.5 into diffusion coefficient that is given 0.7 into 10 raised to power minus 5 and centimeter square per second that is the unit required for the equation m milligram per second yes that is given in milligram per second that is 4.2 raised to power 2 by 3 and time t in seconds drop time so that is 7 seconds raised to power 1 by 6 all are given in the units required for the equation now this is just a solution now So six zero seven into two into two point five into. Let us write it as seven into ten raised to power minus six, raised to power one by two. Sorry, I forgot. One by two into four point two raised to power two. So four point two raised to power two. The value comes out to be. For for the sixteen seventeen point six four raised to power one by three, and seven raised to power one by six. Its value is one point three eight three. So it is equal to six zero seven into two into two point five, and seven raised to power one by two. It is two point six five, and ten raised to power minus six raised to power one by two. That is ten raised to power minus three. Seventeen point six four cube root. The value is nearly two point six into one point three eight three. So when we 
multiply all of them so value comes out to be 28920 into 10 raised to power minus 3 nearly and result is in micro ampere so value comes out to be 28.92 micro ampere so this is the answer of this particular question i hope you understood this question if you like this video do subscribe my channel and share with your friends so that all will be benefited god bless you all happy learning jai hind jai bharat